In this lesson, we're gonna learn about adding vinyl to resin for personalization or branding or just to make your resin piece look cute and unique. Adding vinyl to my resin pieces is something that I, I hadn't seen a lot of people doing when I started selling my pop sockets and badge reels in my Etsy shop. And so my pieces started standing out because I was able to personalize them, but also allow it to have that polished, finished look. When you add vinyl to resin and then you cover it with another layer of resin on top, that's called doming. And when you do that, it looks so professional and so polished. What you're doing is essentially sandwiching the vinyl between two layers of resin, the background color, then the vinyl, then the clear doming resin that you put on top. All right, so here I'm starting out with three resin circles that I've already made and cured and popped out of the mold. On the teal one, I'm going to be adding a monogram. On the white one, I'm going to be adding a sticker made from printable vinyl. The design on this sticker is one that I drew on my iPad using Procreate. Then I transferred it to my Cricut and printed it out onto printable vinyl. And on the third piece, the pink one, I'm going to be adding just a fun saying that's also cut out of white vinyl. I'm gonna start with the printable vinyl sticker. I just peel the backing off, line it up with my resin piece, and then apply it. With the printable vinyl stickers, you wanna make sure that there are no air pockets underneath that sticker, so make sure that you're really smoothing it out and paying attention to any pockets that might have formed underneath. Next up, I'm going to apply the vinyl to the pink resin circle. I place the transfer tape on top of the vinyl and smooth it out. Then I slowly peel it back off of the blue backing paper and line it up onto the resin piece exactly where I want it. And then I apply it and smooth it all the way out. I'm gonna do that same thing with the teal monogram one. When you're applying vinyl to resin, really pay attention to any air pockets that might have formed. Get rid of those now, smooth them out before you put the doming layer on. Now we're ready to dome these pieces. We're gonna use this doming mat and put it underneath. The doming mat is kind of spiky, so it allows there to be space between the resin piece and your flat table. If any resin happens to drop off of the side of your piece, it'll just flow down onto the mat. So we're gonna mix up some clear resin and then start applying it to the top of the resin piece. We're wanting to create surface tension here, so push the resin all the way out to the very edge of each piece, but don't let it fall over the edge. Go all the way around the rim, making sure you fill in the center, and just take your time here to make sure that you fill the whole piece with resin. After all of the pieces have the doming layer on, I'm going to use my heat gun, and then I'm gonna let these cure overnight. And that's it, it's that easy to apply vinyl to your resin pieces. Whether you're using a personalized monogram or name or another type of cut file, or you're using stickers or digital art that you've made, you can absolutely turn a regular resin piece into something beautiful and dynamic. All right, so let's go to the next lesson so that you can see how I'm using these pieces to create some cool accessories.